Diogenes the Wise Man by Anonymous. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. At Corinth in Greece there lived a very wise man whose name was Diogenes. Men came from all parts of the land to see him and hear him talk. But wise as he was, he had some very queer ways. He did not believe that any man ought to have more things than he really needed, and he said that no man needed much. And so he did not live in a house, but slept in a tub or barrel, which he rolled about from place to place. He spent his days sitting in the sun, and saying wise things to those who were around him. At noon one day, Diogenes was seen walking through the streets with a lighted lantern, and looking all around as if in search of something. Why do you carry a lantern when the sun is shining? Someone said. I am looking for an honest man, answered Diogenes. When Alexander the Great went to Corinth, all the foremost men in the city came out to see him and to praise him. But Diogenes did not come, and he was the only man for whose opinions Alexander cared and so since the wise man would not come to see the king the king went to see the wise man he found diogenes in an out-of-the-way place lying on the ground by his tub he was enjoying the heat and the light of the sun when he saw the king and a great many people coming he sat up and looked at alexander alexander greeted him and said diogenes i have heard a great deal about your wisdom is there anything that i can do for you yes said diogenes you can stand a little on one side so as not to keep the sunshine from me this answer was so different from what he expected that the king was much surprised but it did not make him angry it only made him admire the strange man all the more when he turned to ride back, he said to his officers, Say what you will, if I were not Alexander, I would like to be Diogenes. End of Diogenes the Wise Man by Anonymous Socrates and His House by Anonymous This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information or to volunteer, please visit LibriVox.org. There once lived in Greece a very wise man whose name was Socrates. Young men from all parts of the land went to him to learn wisdom from him, and he said so many pleasant things, and said them in so delightful a way, that no one ever grew tired of listening to him one summer he built himself a house but it was so small that his neighbors wondered how he could be content with it what is the reason said they that you who are so great a man should build such a little box as this for your dwelling house indeed there may be little reason said he but small as the place is, I shall think myself happy if I can fill even it with true friends. End of Socrates and His House by Anonymous